this video, I'm going to give you a tour of the AI teacher tool, EduAid. It's called the Teaching Assistant. So you can uh, log in with your Google account or you can sign up with email. I'm going to go ahead and launch the tool. And this is just going to be a general overview to show you around. So first of all, you can expand this menu and you can see what all of the tools are available within EduAid. So we're here on the content generator and notice you can change the subject from science, social studies, math, language, arts, and enrichment. And depending on what you choose here, you will get some different resources down here. So um, try them all out and make sure you're aware of what's included in each resource source. Um, you can also specify the grade. So we're going to say we're working with third grade students today. So across the top are the tabs that categorize the different content generators. So under the planning tab, notice that you have a variety of tools here from Lesson Seed, which just gives you a basic lesson outline with some different techniques and strategies and activities that you can use. Uh, there's a rubric generator. There's a lesson plan 5Es generator, um, a variety of tools here. If we switch over to information objects, these are um, another set of tools here from a direct instruction script, which can be really useful if this is the first time you've taught a particular subject. Um, we'll give you a step-by-step -step, uh, direct instruction script that you can use, an anchor chart, um, there are sentence stems that you can use, a slides outline. It won't create the slides for you, but it will give you an outline that you can use in a slideshow creator. If we go to independent practice, you'll see that we have exemplar essay reviews to mock studies, to research projects, reading comprehension assignments, cooperative learning activities, a jigsaw activity or a station rotation activity. Uh, this is great if you've ever put up together a station rotation, you know it's very time intensive. So this can save you a little bit of time here. Think pair share activities. Um, if you're, again, we're in science, so we're going to have a lab and material list activity based here. And if we slide over, we'll see we have some gamification options from creating a Jeopardy style game to an escape room. And then finally, we have a question generator uh, with a variety of different types of questions that we can generate. As we go down through the menu here, notice that the next tool is assistant. And again, we can choose our grade level. So we'll say third grade and professional duties. So these are things that will help you uh, save time with your administrative tasks from creating class announcements to um, email. So perhaps you get an email from a parent. This will give you a tactful way to guide your writing in that email response. There's a syllabus starter, a newsletter outline, report card comments, learning skills comments. We slide back up and we check out accessibility. Here we can generate an IEP outline or an accommodations list, a behavioral intervention plan, Lexile increaser or decreaser, inclusive strategies, action steps, lots of helpful things there. And then finally, under wellness, we'll find SEL activities, mindfulness activities, icebreaker, digital citizenship lessons, conversation circle, so a variety of activities here. We slide back over to our uh, menu. The feedback bot will allow us, will help us generate actionable feedback for students. So what you do here is you copy and paste in a student assignment. Uh, without any personally identifiable information, of course, and it will give you some feedback for the assignment. Or maybe you're looking for typographic feedback, spelling and checking for spelling and grammar errors, syntactical feedback, uh, the mechanics of writing, semantic feedback, logic and reasoning of writing, or custom feedback using your own rubric. Then we have the EUA, the EduAid chat bot, um, and this will ask you, this, you can put in any request here and help brainstorm new ideas. And then finally, we have an assessment builder. So you can put in, again, a standard or a topic and a grade level. So if we choose third grade, and it will generate questions for you, multiple choice, true, false, short answer, fill in the blank, matching essay that you can then use and create your own uh, quiz from. All of your content, all of the uh, things that you generate within EduAid will be saved here under saved content. 
if you look at your settings, you can see that you can choose some preferences. So maybe I want uh, my output language to be different. I can specify the grade level so I don't have to select that each time. And I can specify a default subject again so I don't have to specify that each time. So Edu EduAid has lots of tools in here that will surely save you tons of time.